Hello viewers and welcome to my channel. It's Leonard here from DigitalLeonard.com, Digital Marketing Consultant. And in this video, I'm going to actually walk you step by step on everything you need to know about the CHYMO platform. Whether you're a new user, you're trying to navigate your back office, or you want to join and yet you want to get there, you're trying to get a better understanding of how the platform works. I'm going to explain everything in this video to make sure that I carry along and you get a better understanding and how to navigate your back office. So basically, I'm going to start by explaining what CHY Mall is all about, how it works, and how you can be a part of it for those who are new into the platform who are skeptical. Maybe you'll be making research on whether it is legit or not. That is why you came across my video, then you are in the right place. And I'll try my best to explain everything you need to know and for those who have joined or when you join i will equally show you how to navigate your back office so in this one video i'm trying i'm going to actually explain everything you need to know about this platform and how to navigate your back office and how best to manage your accounts and start trading with the CHY more platform now the question i get asked a lot i know the CHY more platform has been around getting to two years now and sincerely people are asking is it paying is it legit well i don't know what your uh, what your assessments are what you assess any company that is legit or not with but sincerely for getting to two years now this platform has been paying and seriously the product that they promised you to sell now when i go to the e-commerce here to um the traditional e-commerce that you would just seen here the ECM means the e-commerce you see all of these different products that are, are, are listed here these are not the products that the vip members of the platform trades these are normal day-to-day -day, um, activity, casual uh, product, and the rest that we use from day to day. You talk about bag, clothing, bags, shoes, um, all of these different um, products here. This is not what is traded in um, the VIP. Here, on the VIP, as a VIP member, what you are trading are these quantum energy products that are created, that are produced by the platform by chy more platform um, where, um factory itself they, they are the one who produce this product and they are very effective so these products are very effective you have the water purifier you have the phone stickers the spray the eyeglasses all of these different from vip1 down to vip6 they are all product that we trade so in becoming a member of chy more you need to first become a VIP member if you want to earn this passive income. This is specifically for those who need passive income. If you are out there and you really need some way to be making some little, little money every 10 days into your bank account, then CHY Mall is that option for you. It is not meant for everybody. So it is not a must that you must join for those of you who are not yet convinced but I'm telling you, for the time being that I've been in this platform, there is no other networking platform that I can compare. Those I've done and maybe those I'm yet to do that I can compare to CHY more presently. And that is why it's making wave everywhere. So if you're out there and you're still skeptical, you can be a part of it. All you just need to do, uh, my WhatsApp number will be in the video description. If you want to be a part of my team, we can help you get a better understanding. If this video uh, don't do that, uh, but... I'm trying my best to make sure you get a better understanding from this video and you can be a part of this by becoming a member and these are the different VIP levels that CHY Mall offers from VIP 1 down to VIP 6. Now when you register, when you become a VIP member, there are registration fees that are paid to CHY Mall and this is a one-time non-refundable registration fee that is paid. This money is used to buy your shop. For those of you who are business owner, you go to one market, you have a shop there, you go to another, you have a shop. So you can do same with CHY Mall. And every 10 days, you get your returns from the platform. So the registration fee for VIP1, you can only register with um, $25, which is equivalent of uh, 9500 in Naira. And when you register with VIP1, the only way you can make money with the VIP1 level is by referring people into the system. 
So when you become a member, you lock in yourself. Let's say for those who say, I don't have money to start, you can start with VIP1. But your duty now will be to refer other people into the platform. And when you refer them into the platform, you earn money for doing that. And from the earnings you are getting, you can upgrade to a higher package where you can now start trading and be earning money every 10 days. But from VIP2 down to VIP6, you can earn money every 10 days even without inviting anybody and that has to work with the new retail concept kind of business that Sageway more offers where you trade you buy and then you place for sale and after 10 days the products are sold and you are credited with um, your, your capital your trading capital and the profit you made for that, selling that particular product so that is achievable from VIP 2 down to VIP 6 so when you join with VIP 2 you pay a registration fee um, for owning your shop. This shop is for you for life. And you can always withdraw your capital and put back the capital to start trading again. So you pay this one time registration fee and then this is your trading capital. So the registration fee plus the trading capital gives you the total amount of money which you will be paying to the platform, which is in this case, if you are joining with VIP2, you are paying 53200 which is $140. And this is what you will use at the end of the day. This is given to the platform as your registration fee, and this is the amount you'll be trading with. So from this amount you are trading with, you'll be making a profit of around um, $2,000. From, uh, for the, if it is for VIP2, you're making a profit of $2,007 in 10 days. And in one month, this is the amount of money you're making. That means in one month, you would have traded like three times. And if you trade three times, if you succeeded in trading three times, you will be able to make this amount of money, $21 or $7,918 in a month. Then when you continue this process of trading in the platform for seven months, approximately seven months, you would have made back the money you invested, both the registration fee and your trading capital. You would have made all this money back. So in seven to one, in seven months to one year, you would have made back your money, and whatever you have in the platform becomes your profit, and that you can use to start trading again, again and again and again and again. So from VIP two to VIP six, you don't need to invite anybody, you don't need to refer anybody. You no, know, those those of you who don't. You know, that headache of going to convince people to come and join business and the rest. You don't need to do that. But hey, when you start seeing the dividends, when you start seeing the benefit of being in this platform, you have no choice than to tell people. Because the more you tell people about this, the more you bring opportunity to them that can change their life. So basically, um, for a start, you don't need to invite anybody. You can start with VIP 2 to VIP 6 and you start earning money every day. So this is the amount you're expected to end every month if you trade three times. Um, this is the amount you're expected to end every 10 days. For VIP 3, you'll be making about 5,000 plus, um, which is $14 every 10 days. For VIP 4, you are making $42, which is 15,916 Naira every 10 days. For VIP 5, you are making 31,920 Naira every 10 days, which is $84. And for VIP 6, you are making 63,000 eight hundred and forty naira or one hundred and sixty eight dollars every ten days and in one month you are making one hundred and ninety one thousand five hundred and twenty naira which is five hundred and four dollars every one month that is every every month if you have traded three times so take out your time you can pause this video and go this is the vip level this is the registration amount this is the trading capital so this plus this, which is what you are joining with, gives you the total amount. So for VIP 2, you are joining with this amount. For VIP 3, with this amount. VIP 4, with this amount. VIP 5, with this amount. And VIP 6, with this amount. And then profit after 10 days are what you get every 10 days. This is what you get every 10 days for trading in this platform. And the one month profit are what you get every month. And in seven months, this is the returns you would have gotten just trading in the platform. Then in one year, this is equally the return you are getting. You can imagine investing 1.2 million naira in this platform, and in the end of one year, you are making 2.2 million naira. That's like double um, your money. So 
uh, you can go ahead and uh, pause the video take a look at this chart and get a better understanding of this now when you plan once you've decided that this is the vip level you want to join with you come here to the platform you have to join to someone uh, because it is equally multi-level marketing now you have to join um, through someone's link and when you join to become a member first you come here to where it says be a vip now the money you are paying could be in dollar in naira in or in your currency in your country in your country's currency the money you are going to pay could be in your country currency but this money have to be converted to the chy more currency which is um chy point so the currency that CHY Mall accept is CHY point and CH uh, consumption point. And for emphasis, please, for those of you who are in this platform already, consumption points are used. Okay, let me go to my back office and explain that before I come back here. So if I come here to recharge, you will see consumption points and you will see my CHY points. These are the two currencies that CHY Mall accepts. So your Naira, your dollar, your whatever currency you have will first be converted to two of these. This one, the consumption points are used only for activations of account. When you register, you want to activate your account. The what you will use to pay for that is consumption points. So you are using consumption point and that is why when you contact me that you want to join i will request that you send your money to actually join the platform because we will need to convert it but you can do that from the platform here and if i come here to the recharge and you want to recharge your, your account you can come here to either recharge consumption point or recharge CHY point but normally for inactive account because of all of this error when you come here to buy, let's say somebody wants to buy a um, thousand plus, or let's use the VIP four for instance, you are buying a point worth eight hundred and forty dollars, and then you come here and buy consumption point of eight hundred and forty dollars. You cannot convert back this consumption point to CHY point. That is why you have to go through someone who is in the platform already so that they will get you registered you send your money to them and they send you the points to activate your account if you want to do this yourself at times it is confusing some persons will come and come and buy consumption point of um the total amount they are supposed to invest and once they buy this normally what you are supposed to buy the consumption point is just supposed is supposed to be only the registration fee because you can only use this for registration and once it is consumption point you cannot convert it back to chy more um to chy point and if your account is inactive you cannot do all of these conversions you cannot send to anybody except you activate the account so basically you convert these points to chy point to from chy point to consumption point all these are done with an active account and then they can send it to your own um inactive account to activate the account so please and please i want to emphasize this if you are joining you need to contact somebody that will send you will send your money to and then the person will use that money to activate your account i know the issue of trust are there but um i can only speak for myself that i've done this even for those who are home and abroad that i've not met i am i don't know them from genesis and i've done this for them i it is not my intention to run away with anybody's money so once you become a member first you register um once you register your account you come here to be a vip once you come here to VIP, be a vip the registration during the registration you'll be asked to select a vip level so if you select a vip level once you select a vip level this is where you come to activate that vip level you selected for instance if you have selected vip6 you come here to select the product once you click on be a vip you come here to select the product for be the vip vip6 and then when you click here the quantity just select random the color select random and then click on buy and once you click on buy to take you to where you make the payment once you make the payment in this case since it is be a vip you are paying with consumption point so your consumption point will be up to it, it, it um, one hundred and one thousand two hundred dollars 
to be able to activate for this particular account. So this is um, to all of the different levels. You have VIP 6, VIP 1, VIP 5, VIP 2, VIP 3, and VIP 4. So whatever VIP level you join with, you just go ahead and click on the product. Once you click on the product, the quantity is yes, select one, the color is yes, select um, picture, and then go ahead and click on buy. Once you click on buy, your account will be activated. If you are hover over my username, you see it will show you um, account status activated. So your account will be activated. Once your account is activated, the next point you need is CHY point to start trading. And there are two forms of trading. And the one that is easier for me is the auto trade. So you can come here to where it says auto trade and the auto trade you have for 10 um the, the system will automatically be doing the trading for you for either 10 times or five times so the 10 rs you are seeing here is 10 times which is 100 days the five rs you are seeing here is um five times which is 50 days so you can just come here to select any product that is particular to your vip level once you select the product you go ahead and then select when you say product select pictures where you say uh, quantity select one and then you click on buy once you click on buy you go you it takes you to the next screen and you just go ahead and pay once you pay in this case because you are trading you are paying with chy point so once you pay your auto trade will automatically start counting so once it start counting every um 10 days your 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 profit will drop and it keeps dropping until when this time complete the 10 days uh, the 10 times complete the capital and everything will be dropped to your account and then you start all over again you you renew it so that is how the auto trade works the system do the thing uh, the trading automatically for you but if you want to be doing it every 10 days you can just go on to where it says the new retail here you go to the new retail and then click on any product that is particular to your vip level so if you click on any product that is particular to your VIP level, you go ahead where it says quantity, select two, where it says color, select picture. And then once you select this, you just click on buy now. And once you click on buy now, you go to the next page where you are going to pay with CHY point. Again, for trading, what you use is CHY point, not consumption point. So don't go and convert the whole of your points to consumption point and think you can trade with it. Once you convert it to consumption point, you cannot use it to trade again. And then you cannot convert it from consumption point back to CHY point. You can only use it for registration. So please take note of that. So once you click on buy now, you just go ahead and pay with CHY point. And after buying from the new retail here, buying one product, you are just buying only one from the new retail. Once you buy and pay successfully, the system now gives you that opportunity. If you don't buy from here, you cannot buy from the wholesale. And the product you buy from the new retail here is sent to you through your service center. So the way CHYMO has programmed um, their platform is that you, the products are not sent to your individual addresses. Even when you are going to put your address when you are registering, it is not sent to you individually. But if your service center wants to send it to your home, they can get your address from your back office if you send it to them and send those products to to. To your address but normally what CHY model does, does is that they send all of this product after a month or two to your service center so it is not the responsibility of your service center to send or alert you that the products are available you go get the product or they will send it to you it all depends on how your service center operate so you go get the product from them or they send the product to you so the one you are buying from the new retail store comes to you. Some persons have asked me, is there no way I can place back the product for sale? No, you cannot place back the product for sale. And that is why the platform has proved that they are legit because they have a physical product that you can actually use. You cannot place back the product from the new retail for sale in the platform. The only product you can place for sale is the one you are buying from the wholesale tab. So this one will come to you. You can use them or you can sell them if you want. Then, when you buy one from the new retail, the next thing you need to do is to come to the wholesale tab here and buy that same product that is particular to that VIP level. The same product you bought from the new retail, the same product you are coming to buy here. In this case, you are buying it at a 60% discount, as you can see here. So, um, if, if I go here now and click on the VIP 3, 
you will go again where you say quantity select to where you say color select picture and the quantity here again this is where you add it to be true so you are buying two of this product at a 60 percent discount so it is only here that you will select to please take note again here on the wholesale tab is where you will select to so if if there is any error if you don't do it right the system will not because it has been programmed to just do everything you do here step by step if there's any error it won't go through when you click it select to here make this one too by clicking on this plus button and then click on buy and pay with your chy point and after paying it will ask you to view orders and um, this account will not uh, allow me to, to place a trade but if you, it will ask you to view order if you don't click on the view order you can come here to where it says my orders once you come here to where it says my orders you will see where it says um, um, deliver to me and sell once you successfully place your order for from the wholesale tab you will see deliver to me and you will see sell so all you are just going to do is to click on sell and once you click on sell the product um the the, the registration the product will start counting here for you and once it start counting here for you after 10 days it will drop and you repeat the same process again that is if you want to be doing it 10 10 days you buy from new retail you go to wholesale you buy and then you go to the uh, the, the uh, my orders and don't click on sell and once you click on sell after 10 days it drops and those products are sent to you so just as you are buying here and placing for sale a lot of other persons are equally buying here and placing for sale but the thing is that the new retail product will come to you there is no way you can sell it back in the system the only way you can sell is the from the wholesale tab and another thing i need to address here before i go to the back office is that you can only sell one product in 10 days per a vip account if you join with vip2 account the only product you can sell is this quantum ring if you join with vip3 account the only product you can sell is this um, the quantum energy card so all of these uh, products that you are seeing here are particular to vip level you cannot place two trade at a go you know i don't know why people want to do that the system has been programmed that in 10 days you can only trade one product in that account i know if people have their way they would have been trading 100 product with a particular account but it is it does not allow that so you can only trade one product in that account and after that product has been sold after 10 days you can now repeat the process again so if you want to earn more you can either upgrade or get a higher account so for vip6 you can only trade one product for this vip6 for vip5 you can only trade one product and so on and so forth so you can only trade one product per account so basically for those of you who are here to understand or who are here to join um that this is basically what i needed to explain to you um for, for just trading i have a video on compensation plan of the chy mall which i will leave a link in the video description for those of you who want to build this as a business go to that video get a better understanding of how the compensation plan works um, this uh, you get a better understanding of the six different ways you can end with the chy mall platform and then you see how you can build up your business and once again if you want to be a part of this business uh, links to contact me via whatsapp will be in the video description and i'll be happy my team and i will be happy to help you um, succeed in this business i will make sure that you get every help that you need when you need them that is one good thing when you are selecting a team you want to join make sure you select a team that will give you when you call they will not be so busy a team that will give you what you need to know when you need them and all those so we make provision for a lot of um, meetings tutorials and then whatsapp group where we can help everyone grow in this business and get a better understanding of it so once you become a member of this platform you will need to log in with your password and your username and once you log in you see the red tab here please this thing i'm doing you can do it on your mobile phone but i'll leave a link to download the mobile app the interface of the mobile app is different but if you are accessing the website directly from your mobile phone this is what it will look like this is what it will look like you will need to scroll down this way and then from here you scroll down this way you get you need to go left right and then 
up and down so when if you are assessing this from your uh, from your phone it is the same thing all this i'm explaining you will see it here and once you log in you will see your username on top of your phone here where it says um hi there welcome to chy you'll see it and when you hover over your username you will see where it says personal center if you want to go to the back office so you just hover over your username here and go to personal center if you want to view your order if you scroll down here now once you scroll down to the end here and i go to the to the right this way you will not see the other tab here down here this has to screw up for you to see the other tab if you screw up this way from the beginning here you'll be able to see the other tab so if you have any other you go here and just click on make sure if you are scrolling left or right and you're not seeing the other make sure that you scroll up to the beginning here and you will see the orders here so you see my orders here once you click on it it will take you to where all of your orders are and then you can scroll to see where the order is reading and how it's reading and the rest so whatever i'm explaining here you can do it with your phone so i'm using a laptop but you can do this with your phone so once you log into your account as a, a, a new member you go to hover over your username and then click on or just click on it if you are using a phone just click on this arrow and then click on personal center when you click on personal center this is your back office this is your back office this is where you are going to assess everything now to know when your trade is counting well, well maybe the numbers of days that are remaining all you just need to do after placing the trade either auto or the manual trade you come here to where it says my orders and click on my orders this is where you will see all of the details about your trade so once again if i go back to my personal center here this is where it will bring you to the user id is your username user id is your username so here you are going to update this information now to be able to update this information here where you have your full name your mobile um, uh, phone your email all of this and then bank account where you want to withdraw to and your btc wallet to be able to update this once you go to your personal center the next thing you will need to do is to click this is your username here hmm? if i minimize this let's say you are accessing this with a phone you can equally see it here this is your username here so you just go ahead and click on it go ahead and click on this your username once you click on the username it comes up this way you can change your icon by adding a photo here you just click on it and it will open up your gallery and you can select your picture so your picture is supposed to be the one that is here you just select and upload your, your photo there and then the user id is your username as you can see your username that you created this is what your username is so once you click on this i am your username here you'll be able to edit this you go ahead and add your full name here add your mobile number the email address is not necessary and that is why it is grayed out so you cannot put an email address here and then when you scroll down here okay then the membership iv is the vip level you join with your referrals id is the one who referred you and then the placer id is the person you are directly under that means this person is under the person who referred you and you are under that person um, under the person who referred you so the placer id means someone else below that person um, who referred you or who registered you below him and then you are under the person so that is what the placer id is and the service center id is the id of the service center where you'll be getting your product from so basically this is what is there and then for the bank name you will need to select the bank you want to be withdrawing your money for for nigerians you can only withdraw to a uba account or a zenith bank account so you go ahead and scroll down here um, i'm using nigeria because i'm in nigeria you can use any other you see all of the different bank bank um, here for senegal for all of these you know togo all of your country the countries where you are any country that does not have a bank here the only way you can withdraw is via bitcoin so if you're in uk if you're in us wherever you are you can only withdraw via bitcoin if you're in any other country aside these african countries that are listed here with banks you can only withdraw to your bitcoin address so I will advise you go learn how to use Bitcoin and start withdrawing your money to Bitcoin. So if you scroll down here and see your bank for Nigeria, um, you will see NIG, yeah, 
NIG, UBA, NIG, Zenith Bank. So any of these banks that you have, go ahead and select the bank. For instance, if I select any of these bank, I will be asked to put account, um, bank account. So this is where you are going to enter the bank account number. The, the bank account holder, this is where you are going to add the name of the account holder. And then for BTC wallet, if you don't have a BTC wallet, just put not available here. If not, if you do not fill any of this, this will not be saved. So for BTC wallet, you go ahead and put not available. For USDT wallet, go ahead and put not available. And after that, you click on save. If I go ahead and click on save without filling this complete information, now you see it will complain that please enter name. And when you enter a name, it will tell you please enter Bitcoin wallet. If you enter that, it will tell you enter USDT wallet. So you must fill all of this information to be able to save. So for BTC wallet, if you don't have any, click no, right, uh, just type in not available here. For USDT wallet, if you don't have any, just type in not available. But if you have, just copy your Bitcoin wallet and paste there, and then the USDT wallet and paste here. Now the two ways when it comes to withdraw, anyway, I, I, I will address that when I get to the withdrawal tab. So once you finish filling in every information here, you go ahead and click on save. Once you click on save, your information will be saved. So next, when you come and say personal center, you will see your full name, your mobile number, and then your bank details here. Then the next one here is uh, my finance. Under my finance, we have recharge. The recharge are for new account. If you want to buy points directly, either consumption point or my CHY point directly from the company, this is where you do that. And the way you do that is come here to select the um, company account where you want to pay to. And as you can see here, for Ghanaians, they can pay directly to these banks, uh, these uh, banks that are listed here. But if you are not in Ghana, if you are outside Ghana, you can pay with either BTC or you pay with Ethereum. So all you just need to do is select the BTC. You want to pay with BTC and it will pop up this address for you. This is the BTC address where you are going to send whatever BTC. Let's say I want to recharge um, VIP5. VIP5 will cost me $1,680. Now, if this account is new, if I buy $1,680 point, CHY point, I cannot activate the account because what i need to activate the account is consumption point so you must be careful you can buy this one after the other um let's say the registration fee which is what i'm going to buy for consumption point is 600 dollars so you come here and um select when you select btc this is the wallet address where you are going to send it to and then the, the you you are going to send this actually so you will send more instead of just sending 600 bitcoin worth 600 dollars you will send more so that when it drops in your account, if it is more for you, fine and good. But if not, if it is less, you will not be able to activate that account. So that is why it's somehow complicated. If you don't understand the system very well, you may not be able to do this yourself. So you need to trust someone to do it for you. And once you copy this address, that is where you are going. You go to your Bitcoin wallet and then send the amount of money you want to send. And where it says uh, recharge amount. You can enter the recharge, the amount you want to recharge. If it is 600, you just go ahead and enter 600 here. And then the exchange rate is where you now select BTC. If you are in Ghana, you are paying to the bank, you can select any of this, um, this currency here, the BTC. And then the, since you have added the amount here, uh, CHYMO will tell you this is the number of Bitcoin. If you send, send anything less, you may have issue. So this is the number of Bitcoin you are going to send. You just copy this Bitcoin here that they have given you and go and send it. So when you send it, they will definitely recharge your account with these points um, that you have put here. If it is consumption point or whatever you selected. Then at the end of the day, when you do this transaction, your hash, your transfer, your transaction link from your Bitcoin, you are going to paste it here. And then the recharge type, you will now select whether you want CHY point or consumption point. Once you select this, you go ahead and select your country. Once you select your country, at the end of this, once you successfully send this um, Bitcoin, take a screenshot of the um, screen uh, showing the success of your transaction and upload that screenshot here. Once you upload the screenshot here, and now when you are sending it, I have actually a video on that, which I will leave the link in the video description on how to recharge. I'm not going through this uh, so that this video will not be too lengthy. A video on how to recharge which walk you through doing this and when you are recharging you use your random code to do that 
so that is what the recharge is all about you use it to recharge your account directly from the company if you want more details there will be a video in the uh, a link to the video that talks about recharging in the um, description video description below and the next tab here is withdrawal once you are able to update this information initially that i show you you will see all of the details here that you want to withdraw now when you come here all you just need to do is where you say withdraw amount just add in the amount you want to withdraw and the minimum you can withdraw is 20 points the minimum you can withdraw is 20 points and withdrawals are done once a week withdrawals on CHY mall are done once a week so the withdrawal method you go ahead and select if it is btc usdt or bank you go ahead but what i will advise is always select btc or bank these are the two i will encourage you uh, for now leave usdt out of it always select btc you can always withdraw to your btc wallet your bitcoin wallet or to your bank directly so if you have filled this information already when i select btc it automatically pull out the address for you if i select bank it will automatically pull out the information for you your bank account number your bank name the receiving bank all of those information would have been here and once you put in successfully add your payment password and click on withdraw and the withdrawal will go successfully there is equally a video about withdrawal but i just want to show you how this will work in one video then the income details are where you will see all of the incomes you are making for the multi-level marketing if you start referring people and for the new retail once every trade happens um, on your, from your account the amount of money you are earning from those who are trading you see the details where it says the new retail and then the multi-level is everybody you're referring to the platform the amount of money you are earning this is where you'll be getting it from this income detail and then the currency flow are the money that are coming in and out of your account how much you received how much that was sent out and the rest this is what um that is shown on the currency flow here then if you want to upgrade from one level to another you do that with the membership of upgrade the members upgrade here where is the member upgrade this is where you do that and you have to have um, some consumption points here to do the upgrade so you select first you convert any points you have or you ask someone to send you the points um, you convert the point once you convert the point you will see the consumption point here that means if I'm upgrading from VIP 1 to VIP 2, I'm going to pay additional $50, um, $25. Because VIP 2 is $50, and I've already paid $25 in VIP 1. So I'm going to pay the difference, which is another $25 to upgrade to VIP um, 2. If I'm upgrading from VIP 2 to VIP 3, I'll pay $50, additional $50 to make this registration fee. That is what happens when you are upgrading. So you upgrade, you pay the difference from the current one you have and the one you want to upgrade to. So that means if I wanted to upgrade from VIP1 to VIP2, I would have had 25 consumption points here to be able to do this. And then you select the VIP level you want to upgrade to, VIP2, and then upgrade the deduction amount. So you go ahead and select consumption point because it will be deducted from your consumption point. And then you add your payment password and click on submit once you click on submit you'll be successfully upgraded from this level to the other level and then you can now make up your trading capital to the amount uh, the the amount of that um, particular level you just upgraded to so that you'll be able to start trading as well so that is for the member upgrade and then the currency exchange is where you exchange points from one point to another that is you exchange from my CSY point to consumption point so here when you come here you will see your uh, all of your CSY point here now if you want to convert it let's say you want to register someone you will need to have consumption point and where you will have that you exchange from your CSY point to consumption point is here so you come here to where it says select exchange type you click from CSY point to consumption point so the only conversion you can do is that you can convert from chy point to consumption point you can convert from chy uh, point to boutique point but you cannot convert boutique point to chy point you cannot convert some consumption point to chy point so when you are doing this conversion be careful so that you don't convert the whole of your point and then when you want to withdraw you have nothing to withdraw because you can only withdraw chy point so you select for instance i want to register someone with a vip 
um from six let's say 600 point i'll just come here and say okay i want to convert from CHOI point to consumption point and then the quantity i can just click here and add here 600 and once you add 600 you click on uh, here to add your payment pass so once you click on payment once you add the payment pass or so you go ahead and click on submit and once you submit those points will be successfully converted from your current balance um, which is a stationary point to the consumption point and you can now use that to register someone we'll get to that how to register and then if you want to transfer points to another person within your service center now transfer of points are done with this service center if you're in a different service center and, I'm, and i am in a different service center you cannot transfer your points to me so your points can only be transferred within your service center either to your upline or to your downline or directly to anybody in your service center so that is where, what you do with this p to p that they are having here so the personal to personal person to person transfer is done within the service center where you belong so you go ahead and put in the username of that person you want to transfer the point to you go ahead and put in the username here then the um select the exchange type you go ahead if it is consumption point you want to transfer or CHY point just go ahead and select depending on the balance you have here on your consumption and CHY point so you can only transfer consumption and CHY point and then you enter the quantity here you want to transfer putting your payment password and you click on submit this is immediate it, it, it is immediately you just click on submit the person gets it immediately so that is how you do your p2p using this tab here and the exchange rate is when you want to know um, the equivalent of whatever you want to exchange from one currency to another so the currency holding here is always by default so if you want to convert it to let's say btc i want to convert know the number of um, btc i will get when i put in the conversion amount let's say 400 here yeah? if i put in 400 yeah, and i click on conversion it to tell me for 400 yeah, yeah, dollar i'm going to get this amount of um, um this is the exchange rate what they are exchanging it for per bitcoin per dollar and then this is the total of what i'm going to actually get with this so when you times this by 400 this is what you will get if i want to exchange to um the Ghanaian cities there if you want to exchange to your current local currency you just select anyone if it is a terror if it is anyone you want to exchange to just go ahead and select if it is naira if i click on the ng and they have 400 dollars will give me how much if i go ahead and click on convert they are exchanging a dollar here is 380 and 380 by 400 i'm going to get 152 um, thousand naira. so this is what you do with this exchange rate and then the one usd um pack record uh things if i will show you that those when you go to the home page yeah, that is where you see all of those records if you are participating i think i don't know when those um expo um and then all these quiz are i think um let me just go to the front page here where you see this world expo the lucky buy the quiz um this flash sales you can participate in all of this that they do here so that is what you see the record you equally get the record where um where was i the the one dollar the quiz record all of those if you participate in any of those this is where you see the record and then the next tab here say my services my services is where you have the invitation link comment and the rest so if you come here to the invitation link this is where you generate a link that you send to your prospect who wants to register and here i want to emphasize that before you send the link to someone make sure that the person is ready to register and activate his or her account because I've, have, I've had experience where some people just say send me a link send me a link and once they register they forget about it and the thing is once they register you cannot register any other person under them until that account is activated i will show you that in the network network uh, diagram uh, in a moment so if you send your link to someone and the person register and abandon the the the, the account and just walk away you cannot register any other person until that account is activated so please take note before you send your link out to people they can just register and be blocking space for you and then someone who is ready to register with their money will come and you will not be able to register that person 
so please take note of this before you send that invitation link so you come here you can generate the invitation link for your left or your right position anyone you go ahead and click on it and then click on create link once you click on create link it will tell you copy and once you copy if it is from your phone it will tell you copy to clipboard that means that's copied the link and you can now go to wherever you want to send the link either via email or whatsapp and paste the link there and send it to the person you want to send the link to so that is where you get your invitation link for my comment um it's not necessary if you have made any comment there that is where you you see the details your recommend then the, all of this this is where you will see everybody that you've recommended to the platform this is where you will see when you click on my recommend it show you the list of all those you recommended to the platform um, or you refer to the platform and then my network diagram is where you see if you want to register somebody directly and you have converted your CHY point to your uh, consumption point then you can now come here to register someone directly you can come here to register the person either on the left or on the right once the account is activated it opens more position so here is showing vacancy but if you activate this account the, all of this other position will be open if you activate this all of this other position will be open so you come here either left or right you just click on register select the vip level now for instance if i exchange my i equally have a video so that i will not make this video too long I equally have a video that show you how to register the different ways you can register people either directly from your account or um, by sending invitation link so you just click on register here but as i said earlier when you are sending invitation link assuming someone has registered here when they register without activating the account it will be showing this yellow so where as you can see here the, the blue here means account has act <coughs> As you can see here, the blue here means an account that has been activated, and the yellow here means account that is inactive. So if they register and they do not activate the account, you will not be able to register anybody under here or here until the account is activated. So if you want to be a vendor, this is where you go, you go and apply, you put in your, your store name, you select your country, select logo, and all of these different options here, and you become a vendor and all of these options they are not necessary these are for you know those who want to build service centers and the rest and you can if you want to be a center this is where you apply that is when you meet up with the criteria. you just select your country and apply if you have up to 100 downlines whether direct or indirect and you have certain volumes of um, um, points traded on your account in, on a monthly basis you can go ahead and apply to become a service center and then another one that is applied to you now after these services um i think that is that is basically everything you need to know about the dashboard i'll be your back office that is everything you need to know um that is basically everything you need to know about the back office and then if you want to change your password if you want to change your password you just go ahead and click on change login password you put in your current password put the new password you want to change it to and confirm the new password and then click on confirm and you confirm that if it is payment password you want to change go ahead and select it and put in your the, the current payment password put in the the, uh, uh, the new one you want to use put in the confirm the new one and you go ahead and confirm that so basically that is how you navigate your back office and as i said earlier to navigate with your phone you just go you can scroll left right or and then down so basically everything i've showed you here you can do that if you're accessing the website directly with your phone but there is equally a mobile app that makes the work easier for you you can download the, the app i'll leave the link in the video description where you can download the app and then use it to navigate your account so this is just what i wanted to show you in this video and for those of you who are trading at the end of the day maybe when your trade completes and it drops in your app in your account you will be seeing this consumption limit that is showing here it shows here consumption limit and then it's showing the total of what you can do it's not as if you have received consumption point so you did not receive any consumption point when you are seeing where it says on the app it says consumption limit and you are seeing this amount this is the amount for this particular vip account which is vip vip 5 
So this is the amount for the VIP account. What this simply means is that the amount you can trade, the limit of the amount you can trade on this account is this $1,080. It's not as if you have received additional uh, $1,080 one um, um, consumption point. No. It's showing you the consumption limit. This is what you can. This is the limit your account can go. You cannot go above this and you cannot even go below it. That is why I say you can only trade one product per account. You can only trade one product per account. And few things I need to mention here on the withdrawal tab again before I signed up this video is when you withdraw, you can only withdraw once in a week. Let's say, and then withdrawals are, 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 are done um, um, in multiple of 10. You can only withdraw from 20 and above. That means after 20, you have 30. After 30, you have 40. You cannot withdraw 25, 21, 22, or thereabout. So you can only withdraw in multiple of 10. Why? Um, transfer p2p are done in multiple of five that means you can send it equally the limit is equally from 20 and above you can send 20 25 30 35 40 45 and above to anybody you want to send to so when you are withdrawing those of you who are saying i withdraw i withdrew my money three weeks ago i, I have equally said in a video that withdrawals are processed all withdrawals are processed on friday the fact that they are processed on friday doesn't mean it is not automated so when you place a withdrawal and it's still showing on issued in your account, please be patient. Once, even if you withdraw it before Friday, if you don't get it on Saturday, you will get it on Sunday. If you don't get it on Sunday, you will get it on Monday. If you don't get it on Monday, you will definitely get it on Tuesday. So I want to beg you, when you place a withdrawal, be patient about it. And if you have any issue, if your withdrawal is deleted, you have any issue with withdrawal, the best people to contact are support. Me. I am equally an investor and I'm only trying to make sure that you understand the platform um, to be able to navigate through it. So the best people to contact, um, because a lot of, um, you know, a lot of queries that I receive, uh, my account is deleted, how do I restore it? I, I can't do that. You are not in my service center. There are things I cannot do. For instance, if I'm trying to help you regain back your account by contacting support on your on your behalf, it will look somehow support will start suspecting me because we are not in the same service center. Why should I be helping you? It will seem as if I want to go um, and hijack your account and the rest. So there are certain things you you don't need to contact me about. And that is why I say if you want to be a part of my team, then be a part of my team and get all the support that you need. So basically, that is what I want to explain in this video. Um, I hope you get a better understanding of how to navigate your back office now and you'll be able to do this very well. Please, if you don't understand again, go through the video again once more and get a better understanding. And if there is anything I've not mentioned in this video, they just use the comment section below to um, ask your questions and you'll definitely get answers directly from me or from other users who are using this platform. So once again, if you are new to my channel, consider subscribing and hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time new videos like this are published. And until we see again in my next video, bye for now.